It was also a brutal year for some of the world's richest people. 2015 was certainly one to forget for Mexico's richest man. Carlos Slim's net worth taking a multi-billion dollar hit due to volatile markets and government regulations. Martin Markovitz has more. It wasn't the best year for Mexican billionaire Carlos Slim. Once dubbed the richest man in the world, this year, according to the Bloomberg Billionaires Index, the telecom mogul dropped to fifth place. His fortune declined by almost $20 billion as his main holding, telecommunications giant America Movil, had its worst year since 2008. Some of the factors, Mexico's weak in peso and the decline of the company's second biggest market, Brazil. But what may have most affected Slim's fortune are new regulatory rules passed by the Mexican government designed to increase competition in the telecommunications industry. For more than a decade, Slim had a virtual monopoly. His companies controlled more than 70 percent of cell phones in Mexico and 60 percent of fixed phone lines. Then came the regulations. Now America Mobile is forced to let other competitors connect calls to its network for free. It also has to share its infra infrastructure in Mexico with other competitors, which was what had given the company a competitive advantage in Mexico for more than a decade. But many economists say that while Slim's wealth is sliding, the new rules are actually a boom for Mexican consumers. Economist and journalist Jesus Rangel believes this could give more options in an industry that was dominated by Slim's companies. AT&T is offering services in Mexico that have never been seen here before. I think Slim is going to have to make some changes, and I don't doubt that in 2016 he's going to be offering new services like 4G. That is going to help him penetrate the market and lead to lower costs. Slim's fortunes could rebound if Mexico's economy gets reinvigorated in the coming years, as analysts predict. And if his investments in Mexico City's historic downtown, coupled with the expansion of his telecom properties in Europe, are fruitful, there could be a return to form for the 75-year-old magnate. Martin Markovitz, CCTV, Mexico City.